Information Center project which was established in 1985, National Information Center on Disabilities, National Council for Handicap Building. Actually, they are not disabled. It's, it's us who are disabled, a by our minds, and treat them as disabled. We should not. Uh, we should just treat them like normal people and not just tear their disabilities and judge them accordingly. And disabilities don't only run physically; they are mentally also uh, taken into account. Um, there are very a lot of examples and a lot of this is extremely famous movie of Rain Man. Not many people must have seen it, but in that this there's a particular person who is, is really disabled, but he's a genius. They are so much more capable than what we give them credit for. They are just not given the right environment, and they're not provided the right opportunities to pro properly um, achieve stuff and prove themselves. Right, mentally and physically both people are disabled, but we should not only categorize them in that people in that category. Yes, we cannot exactly provide them with the same amount of jobs, or the same amount of opportunities as normal people, because at some point they also have limits with their um, with their disability. But we should help at least that much, a small amount which is which to provide social support for them. We have all seen disabled people as disabled. Yes. Fifteen percent of world population have disability. That means four hundred million. Some of the countries don't even have that population in their countries. Eighty percent of the disabled people live in developing countries. Even though the countries are developing, they don't have the necessary needs for the disabled. People have many more of health issues and mental health issues. When we come to the topic of disability, it breaks a person from inside, his personality. Whenever we see a person who is disabled, he is socially discriminated and he is stigmatized. He feels lonely and that's a very bad thing of our social society. The society mentality should be developed. As for example, we can see Helen Keller and Stephen Hawkins. He was limp, still he changed the past, formed the present and created the future on which our whole perspective of universe is created. Helen Keller, she was the first woman who had three, all the three disabilities. Still, she excelled the art of creation and pouring emotions in the literature. 